when you feel like you're being taken for granted. This can be a tough one and it can be subtle because nobody's necessarily insulting you or doing anything overt. They're just sort of not acknowledging you or just expecting that you're going to take care of business or do certain things. Meanwhile, you can have a lot of emotions coming up, you know, different resentments, different feelings of anger, frustration. So we're going to do some EFT tapping together to help bring up those feelings, to help you process through them so you can feel more centered and calm, which will also help you if you do need to start setting some boundaries. So let's tap here on the side of the hand. Say, even though I feel like I'm being taken for granted, I choose to completely accept myself and all my feelings about this. Even though I feel like I'm being taken for granted, maybe I actually am being taken for granted. There's a lot of feelings coming up around this. And I choose to totally honor everything I'm feeling and honor myself. Even though I feel like I'm being taken for granted. Maybe I am. It might be a difficult thing to prove. Or there might be concrete evidence. But as I'm being taken for granted, I'm not really being appreciated. I'm not really being seen and heard in the way that I need. And this is bringing up all sorts of emotion. And I choose to deeply and completely honor and accept myself, all these feelings that are coming up. Okay, now through the points, I'm being taken for granted. I am being taken for granted. They are not appreciating everything I'm doing, everything I'm contributing, how significant my contributions are. Or if they do acknowledge it, they're doing it silently. They're certainly not making me feel like I'm being appreciated and validated. And sometimes this is a tricky one. Sometimes it can feel, depending on my personality, like, oh, maybe I'm being a little selfish. Maybe I shouldn't expect anything in return. Maybe this is just how it is. Maybe they're not directly insulting me. Maybe it is me. But I'm going to let that relax for a moment and just focus on what I actually feel. Because whatever dictionary definition that people may or may not be falling into in terms of how they treat me, what matters is my feeling right now. what's coming up inside of me. So perhaps I feel frustrated. I'm not being given the credit. I'm not being appreciated. I'm not being understood. Don't they realize 
how important what I'm doing is. They are not seeming to recognize that if I were to stop doing what I'm doing, or stop being the way I'm being, that there would be some problems. I'm adding a lot of value here. And it's being taken for granted. Just being assumed that I should do what I'm doing. And it's not necessarily selfish to want or expect my talent, time, and energy to be received and appreciated and reflected back to me. It's okay to want that. And it is okay, even if it's a little scary, to know that I might need to communicate something here. And depending on the circumstances, I might need to set some new boundaries here. In any case, I'm allowing any feelings around that to just come up now, to be welcomed. Any fear about making any adjustments, any fear of any conversations, and any part of me that might be afraid to stop doing what I'm doing. Because even though it's being taken for granted, we might be afraid of some consequence if I were to stop. And I'm honoring all of those feelings it's important that I validate myself. That I don't take for granted all those parts of me that are working hard and that might be feeling conflicted. Not taking my own inner world for granted. giving myself that space and time right now to say, okay, what do I need? What do I need to do here? What's the right next step for me? Both internally, whether that's welcoming up any more feelings to process, or any conversations or boundaries, or any combination. I choose to listen to myself, tune into what's needed next, honoring and accepting all the feelings that might be coming. There is a way forward. I can be appreciated, and I will find that way forward. Okay, take a breath, hope it helps, and seeing what comes up next, whether that's a conversation, a boundary, I'll link a video about an EFT tapping for boundaries when I make it, that might be a good next topic. If you have any questions, requests, or suggestions, please let me know in the comments. Thanks so much, and I look forward to seeing you again soon.